Hi guys, welcome back to another episode on my channel. Today I want to give my impression and my review on the new niche fragrance that I just recently discovered. I didn't know anything about this house um, that they, they don't really, they even existed, so I didn't know anything about them. But shout out to Mr. Demand Cologne channel. Um, through watching his videos and I start to learn about this fragrance about this uh, house and it's a Turkish house and and I noticed that he compared uh, one of the fragrance of this house to one of the you know goats <laughs> one of the luxurious fragrance Naxos I really love Naxos I mean honey tobacco elegant beautiful scent I love those notes so I had to check out this fragrance so and I usually don't do blind buying but since I look at the on online to see the notes and I really like the notes and then he my good friend he's he also he speak, spoke very highly of this one even compared to next I said no I gotta check this out how good this one is but I usually as I said, don't do blind buy. I usually get a sample before we buy in the niche fragrance. I always recommend getting a sample if you can. Um, let's go toward the presentation and boxes in here. It's the buy house of Unique Luxury. And this one is their collaboration with the Beverly Hills Performery. It's called Beverly Hills Exclusive. I mean, look at this box. I mean, it's just incredible. I mean, the nice design. Look at this art. It gives you a vibe of like a Beverly Hills, and it's just beautiful. And there's a picture of the fragrance in here. Um, and in the back, you get. I'm uh, just going on the side here. Beverly Hills exclusive. On the back, you get the notes and like there's different languages on here. We'll go over the notes a little bit later. I'm just gonna show you the box in this one. It's pretty unique. I mean, you have, can I bring this up? You have this box here, unique luxury, extract the perfume. The website in here, it's just very elegant. It speaks like a high quality. When I open the box in here, very nicely, you know, this box and you get the, uh, Bunch of you know, cards. This is a sort of the fragrance. It's very velvety, soft. You now look at this. And then you have this card you get, Nikki Luxury. Look at this. It's like a. Um, then you when you open it, she gets two cards. This is like a lounge style. And this one is a thank you card. It thanks you for getting this fragrance. And then this one you have the, the picture of crush on me it's the other fragrance and then on the back you get all their current fragrances and all the notes tier too which is kind of cool and this art designs it's just you know crazy it's just the amount of work that i put to this and and you have this paper it says be careful not staining your uh don't spray your, your clothes because you can stain your clothes yeah, I don't want to spray, you know, I always spray it, like it. I spray on the clothes. That's the uh, best one. Yeah, definitely, that's a good advice, you know, because that means it's telling you this is a strong stuff, this is a potent stuff, since it's, 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 it's an extractive perfume. Um, yeah, so just the boxes, I mean, just it's amazing. Um, the amount of the work and detail that they put this one, this is, it speaks like a high quality niche fragrance. The notes on this, on the back of this, are bergamot, clary sage, cardamom, honey, tobacco leaf, tonka bean, rose, orris, sandalwood, ambergris. So, um, let's go over the bottle now. Beautiful. I don't know what else to say about this. It's just that, it just, you know, you know, it's just a high quality, let's look at this cap. I mean, it's just, and it has the logo of the company there. And you have like some diamonds in the middle. 
and it says on the side of here it says unique luxury very golden atomizer golden he has another you know you sign down here unique luxury beverly wheels exclusive um 100 milliliters extract to perform um it just speaks quality elegant it's just a very high quality fragrance from the bottles here and and it's just beautiful bottle um one thing is that uh, when you take it out and when i put it in the, the cabinet it does that sound it's just it's very you know, i love the sound of that and you can also pick the fragrance i wouldn't do it but you can still do that it's very tight um all right so from the boxes to the bottle everything speaks quality i mean but you know what we care about is the scent and let me tell you that is just the best part of this oh my god so when you spray this one you're getting kind of you know you're getting that cardamom you're getting that bergamot a little bit of, kind of like a 20 seconds of that freshy you know wipe comes in but you know what it's just the honey comes in right on the stars the honey is a dominant note in this one is the main player definitely you must like honey to enjoy these fragrances then there is a tobacco leaf comes in very smooth nothing smoky nothing very you know you know harsh it's just then there is it's just then there is a rose comes in there's a tonka bean uh, how do i get the feeling when i imagine that you go to like a beside a tree that, that has a honey on the trees and the honey when you spray this one the honey the actual natural syrupy honey falls on your shoulder then you have a little bit of uh, you smell at the same time a little bit of tobacco leaves you know are from the uh, the grounds and there's a there's a there's a wave waves that comes in the wind comes in and a little bit of the rose petal comes in and you can smell that one too it it's just combination of those three notes that makes this a very special fragrance I mean, the honey is the sweet. There's, the sweetness here is not very gourmandy. There is nothing. It's nothing that it cloying to to annoy you. It's very smooth. It's very balanced. But definitely, honey is the main dominant note because you're gonna smell it from top to the bottom. Tobacco is there, and the rose comes in. They're all in the background, but you can smell them definitely in here. Definitely the rose, I would say, makes this a unisex fragrance. Definitely the ladies can enjoy this one. Um, all year, very versatile. I would say this one is like you could wear it all year around. I mean, the occasion, I wouldn't wear this one to the like it's going to the malls or save this one for a special like a dinner parties, Thanksgiving to you know, Christmas or special events graduation birthdays you know anniversaries yeah it's just a beautiful scent you're gonna get tons of compliments um you do want to spray i would say three spray to four is top is this one is stuff is potent is a strong first two three hours the sillage is just incredible you are getting that honey tobacco you are getting the rose, you're getting tonka bean sweetness. It's just a little bit when it goes through the dry down, you're getting more woody and taco bean. And it's just a small sounds in the dry down, beautiful scent. But definitely, this is like all year longevity. I would say longevity is at least eight to nine hours. I mean, this first two, three hours CH projection is out of this earth. Um, it's very potent if you even put it on your clothes i have it on my clothes here and after a day later you can still smell the honey out there honey and rose i can get it it's just incredible i mean this is one of the blind bars that i'm um, just uh, i thank my friend for introducing this to me um i love it because the moment i saw it, they get you know on online it has honey it's sweet i like rose and he has my favorite honey tobacco and 
uh, tonka beans you know those are sandalwood I love those notes and it's just I just said maybe I have to check this out and I got it and it's just the incredible thing you could wear it all year around you're gonna get massive compliment the first day that I wore what two days ago and the first person saw me and he gave me a compliment so he said oh my god what are you wearing and I said oh wow you know <laughs> it's very versatile it's nothing this and the thing is as I say the sweetness one thing is that I was kind of worries I tell me with this I'm not I'm not so much into the gourmandi sense you know but I like gourmandi sense but the thing is I wanted this to be something like a like a lighter smoother which this one it is and because Naxos is more I would say for evenings you can wear it still Naxos you know it has bergamot lavender you know you can wear it in the you know, daytime too but I would say this one's it's it uh, gives you kind of the honey nose is a lot stronger. One thing is the comparison in here with Naxos is that Naxos you're getting that you know the citrusy and lavender but the thing is in over there is tobacco is I would say it's more the player than than here. Here is tobacco is a little bit toned down uh, definitely the honey is the main player. And honey is a syrupy, juicy, absolutely beautiful. It's a, the best honey scents on the market, in my opinion. It's just amazing scents, and you have tobacco, rose, makes it the floral comes in. The rose is fresh; it's not a dead rose. As I said, when you are in beside a tree with the honey, honey, imagine honey drops on your shoulder, getting tobacco in the air, scents, and that wave comes in a rose beautiful calm and you just imagine you know you just you're enjoying the scents you go to the different room you come back you're gonna hear you're gonna smell this one i mean when i bring my you know my hands to the sides and you know this you can actually you know the the waves of the air <laughs> you're, you're you're actually you're getting the waves of it and it's just so amazing and i'm just blown how good this one is I mean, this house, I mean, uh, speaks quality. I mean, from bottle designs to the presentations to the scents, you know, it's, it's, it's great. I highly recommend get a sample of this one and try. They have other fragrances too. They have a couple of freshies, they have rose one, they have a couple of gourmandis. They have a different fragrance item getting wipes and for different tastes, for different notes. And definitely try some of the samples before you buy them. But definitely I just got it because I really like Naxos. And I really enjoyed that one. I know I love the notes on there. So I had to check this one out. And it has a good reviews online. The house is very underrated. I would say just like a Nishana's from Turkey house. This house, unique luxury. They are just like a this house from Turkey, they're amazing. Definitely, I want to check out some other stuff that they have. Um, yeah, so definitely, so just round it up here. Beautiful box, uh, beautiful bottle. You know, the design speaks like a niche quality, elegant. And the notes are just, you know, it's amazing. Sweet scents, nothing annoying, nothing there is nothing uh, smoky there is nothing like a uh, annoying cloying about this beautiful smooth scents so if you like honey tobacco and rose definitely try this one because this is it's not too floral it's not too gourmandy it's just that there's a balance between the those three notes and there is a tanko bean uh, and the sandalwood notes comes in to uh, smooth it out give it the sweetness and it's just an amazing scent this is all your scents um, just wash your spray maybe in the uh, uh, spring and summer don't go crazy sprays and in uh, winter I would say three four sprays is perfect and what when when you spray one time a lot of juice comes in so definitely you're good beautiful bottle design anomizers beautiful scents my god incredible i mean this is a must-have 
if you love honey tobacco and a bit of rose this is the fragrance that you should try and i highly recommend this one try to get a sample of it and let me know how do you like this one definitely this and and naxos they are right now they're just i would say this is now your the collection is complete because this two can just go back and forth <laughs> they're just amazing scents and i'm just really enjoying it right now or i like it but why i enjoy this one more i would say i really like naxos but the thing is why it gets me because i really like the I like that, you know, floral note to it. I like the rose notes. Access doesn't have definitely in here. I like it, but it's just one thing I like it. It's not too florally. It's just it's there in the background. It gives it, it comes with a tobacco to support the honey. And then you have tongue cup in sandalwood. Amazing fragrance. So definitely unisex, all year around. Sea edge longevity is, is great first two three hours you're gonna get compliment but whoever walks beside you and pass by you and it's just amazing so i guess hopefully you like this uh, video and complete surprise blind boy and i'm really happy about it beautiful scent and i will definitely cherish this scent for good because this is something that i never smelled before and it's very unique and it does live up to its name i highly recommend this uh, beverly hills exclusive and definitely if you like naxos that kind of wipes that and if you like naxos but no lavender but it's just more a little bit of rose you know town coping and just woody notes it's just a beautiful and i highly recommend this one um definitely was the uh, uh, it's great buy and I think I'm really enjoying it right now all right guys thanks for watching let me know if you have this one you're trying to check this one out thanks for you and hopefully you can like and subscribe on this video more video coming soon whenever I have time <laughs> and um, thanks guys and uh, have a good one bye, -bye.